What's good, YouTube? This your boy Chi World back at y'all again with another YouTube video. And today I will be showing you how to turn yourself into a cartoon. A cartoon head. The main thing y'all be seeing on IG has been taking off lately. Thanks to myself. Anyway, without further ado, finna jump right into this video. Make sure you go ahead and subscribe to the channel if you new click post notifications so you will be notified every time your boy drops some heat and without further ado let's jump right into this thing okay first thing you want to do you want to find a picture find a good selfie of yourself as you can see this is not myself though for this tutorial we're gonna use your boy rice gum you feel me so what you want to do you want to find a picture drag it inside adobe illustrator you're gonna click it then you're gonna come to the top and drop the opacity down. I'm gonna bring it to like 61. After you after you got you drop the opacity on the picture, you're gonna lock that layer and add a new layer. Now we finna set our brush. Let me see. Okay, now we good to go. We got our brush set. Now the goal to this, to make these things extra dope, is zooming in close. I'm gonna drop the size of the brush down to 0 0.75. Thank you. 
Okay, so after you done got your line work perfect, because it's all about getting your line work perfect, you know what I'm saying? Now you want to go ahead and select everything so we can merge every line and make it one. Expand appearance. You want to go to your Pathfinder. You want to click Merge. After you done merged it, wait, I'm going to highlight everything so I can kind of center it a little more. Okay, come down here and make a copy of your line work. Lock the top layer. Now we finna start the coloring process. So choose a, a color that's close to his skin tone. With our rectangle tool, we're going to go over the line work, right click it, and we're going to, the color, we're going to send it to the back of the line work, and after you do that, you can look over here and you can tell if you did it right because you'll see your line work on top of the color. So after you do that, you want to click off of it, highlight everything and click merge so it can become one and after you click merge you want to click right back onto it you want to right click it and click isolate selected group now you can click every everything separate that's why it's good to make sure you got everything closed off when you're doing your line work so i'm going to delete this background color how we finna start doing now Okay, come in, I wanna delete that. Now that we got our basic colors down, it's time to do the shading. So what you want to do, you want to go ahead and lock that layer and add another layer and put it between the line work and the color. Now we finna start going in with the detail. I like to start with the eyes, the shadow. Thank you. 
we're gonna add another layer for the highlights We're going to add the last layer at the top above the line work. 